dugout, Virginia Ham's got Elwood P. Seconds for an interview. Okay, Virginia, take it away. Thank you, Rick. Virginia Ham, we're down here in the dugout talking to the picture of the team, Mr. Elwood P. Seconds. I'd like to ask you a few questions, Mr. Seconds, if I might. You've got a very stimulating voice. Thank uh, you. Almost, it borders on being deeply nasal. But uh, you seem to have picked it up and carried it enough to go locally for radio. Well, you're very kind to notice. Listen, you got any trick pitches up your sleeve there? Oh, I, I never talk about what trick pitches. Last year at this time, uh, before about 10 to 12 games, I was asked about trick pitches. I told a woman everything. She's a woman about your size and, and build. And uh, if you replaced her, I don't know. Her name was Jennifer Dimler. I'm a person. I'm not a woman. I'm just a person. But anyway... Well, I'm not into that scene, but at any rate, I can tell you, she asked me my pitches for the day. Well, I got knocked out in the second inning. Everybody knows my pitches. <laughs> they did. And I'm going out the thing. We'll run in their locker. That's what they're doing today, I guess. In one word, describe yourself. In one word? Uh, Roach Link. <laughs> I've always been stepped on. All my life. I just know when I'm buried. I'm going to lay on sand, throw my tombstone. Step on me, everybody else is. Bring up your Roach Link. At least you've got your pride, don't you? You can't go to 31 Flavors and eat pride. <laughs> Thank you very much, Mr. Elwood P. Suggins. It's been a very enlightening interview. And now, back to you, Rick. 